guys came from. I have no idea. That's bizarre. Just glass and it'll pop up right below us. See. There goes our first buck of the day. Jonathan elects to pass on him because he wants to keep hunting. I like his style. I like his style. I don't want to call it quits yet. We've just been here for like an hour and a half. <laughs> Let's just keep spotting him. Yeah, he, he definitely gave us plenty of shot opportunities. Over here. <laughs> That's cool. A little fork on the run. Look at Elias Jace with the spot. Uh, no, that was an easy one. I caught him running. You're the one who caught all of them <laughs> five miles away. <laughs> I just spotted a buck up from up top, so we're gonna move. We're moving down, trying to get into position. We're gonna get up closer, see if it's a buck Jonathan wants to shoot, and uh, we'll go from there. We're coming up on him right over under this rise right here, so I'll try to get some footage of him. Looks like four by four. It looks it's four by four, or three by three, but it's a shooter. Wind's in our favor. You want to cut down and get low? It, it might even, yeah, well, I mean. These trees are just cut down. We could just drop down and try to yeah, just tail them. Yeah, because, uh, uh, I mean, otherwise, <sighs> well, so if we just like snake down these trees, do you want to go up and left and use the contours, or you want to use the little valley where the stream is? I'd say let's, 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 let's drop down in there, kind of start hiking up and just kind of go glass and just see where he's at. This, and is, then this is good because he's on the low side yeah. of that hill, so they can't see him. Yeah, that's a nice block. Holy shit, that is, dude. That's way bigger than what I was thinking of seeing. Oh, windy. It's just a little windy. A little windy. <laughs> Dude, I am stoked. I did not expect to see a deer like so that. You saw the little guy. I saw the little one at first. <laughs> and then that, and then I saw the doe run out of the bottom, and then I just saw that big buck just chasing her. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're gonna try to get in within 200 yards of this deer. We're in some nasty steep stuff. Super steep. Wind's just howling in our face though, so we got that on our side. Okay. Are they down in the bottom yep, again? Yep, yep, yep. Wait, wait, he's coming. Alright, the, the, the deer are moving right into us. We're gonna catch him. They come out at the bottom here, it's gonna happen freaking quick. Yeah. I would just get ready. I would just get ready right now. Get comfy. We hold up right here. Oh, there you go, there you go. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I'll get you a range. 200 yards right now. So anything in me, anything. Just put it dead on, dude. Just put it dead on. He's gonna be within 200 yards the next time you see him. Oh, wait, they see us, they see us. Dude, you need to get in a shooting position. Get comfy. One second, one second. The buck is looking at us a little guy. Don't shoot unless you're steady. Are, are you comfortable I'm shooting not, like that? I'm not comfortable. Here, if you can, work back to me, lay on your stomach, yeah. and shoot over your back. Wait, shit, wait, 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 wait. I'm stuck, I'm stuck. Wait, 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 wait. Hey, lay next to me, dude. Jonathan, unless you got him. I got him. He, he might give you, he'll give you another chance. Hey, he stops. How far is he? He's just 
put it dead on and might stop again. He's 130 yards. Quarter away. No, I don't got him. It's okay. Hey, well, right now. Lay on this. Lay it out. Okay, come on. Oh, we did not, we bumped into him coming across there and he lost us. But we believe he's still down in that, that drainage. Trying to gloss him up. It's a beauty of a buck. Would have been a nice first buck. Uh, <laughs> dude, he was way bigger than anything I expected to see. Yeah, dude, he, he was, was really nice. Cool looking deer. Spot is so sweet. But I couldn't turn up the big buck. So we're back in the, the drainage here trying to turn something up. Got Jonathan out ahead. Really hoping we can find him something. This is just this country down in this bottom is so cool. Look at that. Big old rocks. few hours of daylight. Yeah. Can we get it done? I think we can. We got a couple hours. We're gonna glass here for a little while and hopefully turn up a buck. I'd be happy to see just a deer at this point. It's it's been we've had a dry spell for for a while now. <laughs> we did, we saw a dead deer that someone shot this morning. We saw a dead antelope. We saw a dead. It's a lot of dead, dead things. Of Nothing alive since this morning. So we're gonna change that. Buck, 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 buck. Right where the doe and fawn is. Hundred yard. We're here. He's just crosshairs on the two by two, but he's gonna take a pass. I'm just I'm right on his chest. <laughs> it just seems too easy because if you just crept right up on him, he's just standing broadside like he wants me to do it. But yeah, he doesn't know what the hell's going on. We exactly we I mean I wanna let him get bigger. Hopefully someone will pass him to him next year. But he was with this guy was with Big Hank. That's what I think. I keep wanting like big hang. That's what I'm. Out. That's what I'm saying. Like I want to wait. Like I want to wait ten feet. We've we've got some daylight. So I just like 
I don't know, we spooked him and the doe with Big Hank, so what's to say Big Hank isn't sticking around somewhere? But I'm just like, I'm so steady right on him. If I had this with Big Hank earlier today, he'd be gone. <laughs> We'd be home already. I don't want to be done hunting deer because I was desperate on day one. <laughs> Alright, here we are, day two. Time to get find Jonathan, Big Hank, on the search. We're doing it. For him We're today. out here. The weather isn't as bad as I thought it was predicted. It's supposed to be snowing by now and it's not, so that's a good sign. All right, we gotta take a moment to appreciate this lighting right now. Orange fields, blue skies, and over here, orange sky. This is just so cool. I already saw about six does out in this field. Try to find us a buck. Jonathan spotted a buck. He's, I can't he's decent. Life me find him out there. <laughs> he's elusive, but he's decent. If he were closer and he wasn't flirting with private, I'd for sure shoot him. Alright, we're gonna try to make a move on him. AKA wrap make a giant loop, lose sight of him, and hope he's still there when we show back up. He's got that, yeah, he's got that dough. I think he's gonna chill. He's, he's like, I don't know, he's definitely a two and a half year old. He's, he's a three by three, but he's, you know, he's a skinny three by three, so maybe he's just super pumped to be with a doe and wouldn't, <laughs> wouldn't leave her. So as long as we don't spook the doe and he sees us walking away, I think we can loop around him, get a sneak on him. sneak attack didn't work we've been spotted we could not find them we we came down over this other side of the hill and we were just moving so slowly glass in every step we took could not find them and then of course when we finally do find them they're staring right at us so for whatever reason though they haven't ran yet and we're 350 yards from them and we need to get Jonathan to like 200 yards so he can uh, take a shot so I don't know and we have no like depressions to hide from them and like pop up at 200 yards so our only option here is to maybe just slowly inch our way another 150 yards at them <laughs> with them watching us sounds highly unlikely but it's our only option at this point they're getting real suspicious now she's smelling the air Real good. Jonathan's move, moving in, so I don't know if he's he's made it into like a depression. Oh no, that buck looks like he's looking at him. Oh no, that buck's just rutting that doe. Oh man, he's pushing that doe right now. I need to stand back up and kind of trying to distract that doe. Well, it's been a long day. We bumped that buck in the bottom of this little drainage a while back ago. He ran up at, out of the top, and so he's probably long gone. We're just about to turn around. At the, we went as far as we wanted, and now we're gonna turn around and come back. But I just spotted a little shed. Looks like a little fork mule deer that's been chewed on, and nice and white. I was just kind of looking around back here for some signs. There's a lot of trails. Yeah, three point. White tail, maybe. <clears throat> da -da -da -da. It's always fun to find a little shed. This is my first white tail shed. Shout out. First ever white tail shed. Making history right here. I just found that shed. This is when I took the last video and Jonathan just signaled he sees a buck. Get up on top and see what he sees. Oh shit. It's a 4x4. Four four. Went up the ridge and then down. 
now and he's in that thick, but we're right at the edge. He, so he saw you? Yeah, oh, I don't know. He ran up the edge, didn't seem to look at me, got just stopped in the trees, and then slowly went down. He's got, he's, there he is, there he is, there he is. Yes. He's not big, but he's, he's a four by four, but look, we're so close to the edge though. But like, I wanna go after him for sure. Yeah. He's freaking nice, bigger than that three point. I'm gonna take the pack and just use it as a rest. I'll see. Come this way, come this way. Do you have your gun? Where's he at? He's coming this way in the ravine. Hey, get comfortable. All in the tree. He's just behind this tree. The first one, the green one? The closest to us. I think there might be a doe with him. He's just bouncing around. He's probably chasing her around. <sighs> but he was coming this way. I think there's gotta be a doe in there because he's just like frolicking around in there. Alright. But you did see his body. I saw his body running around back there. I saw him, I saw his antlers and he was coming this way. But for a sec. And then I mean the wind's going right at him. Yeah. I was just looking, I was like, this has got to be perfect freaking deer habitat. And then he just runs up the ridge. I was like, are you kidding me? Jonathan just won up to me. <laughs> My shed is sucks compared to his. This is in the bottom of the river, and it's a grand, that's a that's a nice year. Nice deep point. Oh yeah. Nice. <laughs> Pretty cool. I've never found one in a stream before. Nice. That's epic. Make it. Didn't get a deer, but got a cool shed in the stream. Dude, that's hilarious. It is covered in little like aquatic vertebrae. Oh, yeah. 